Hey there, Leo. Hope you guys' weekend has been good to you guys. Happy Memorial Day weekend to you guys. Let's find out what the cards are saying and what's coming out for you guys' as highest as good at this time. This is for my beautiful sign of Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Leo. How about Leo, please? What are we talking about today? Gate is open. Look for the signs. One more. Planning ahead. You got illusion at the bottom here. All right. There's some kind of gate that's opening up here. Why well, he's planning something? Somebody felt like something was fantasy. Something wasn't real. Some raw energy for Leo. Patience, accepting that everything happens in divine order. Things are meant to play out right when they they were meant to. Something about patience needed to be taking place in order for something to come together. This is like not being in denial about something here. This is like acknowledging things and replacing it with awareness here. So somebody thought that, like somebody was denying something here. Somebody thought that something was too good to be true, but they're realizing that's not the case adversity so this is something that had some challenges put before it something here about there was a reason that something played out as it did because there was some kind of challenges that you the other person both had to overcome both have been through some adversity both of you guys may have felt that something was too good to be true here because you both have been through some things here me and one for leo leo Thank you. Something unexpected may happen. Yeah, this gate opening up here for you, clearly. Here, another one. To search for the truth is right in front of you. I'm telling you, somebody is, this is like no longer denying something. Like, this is realizing that this is what it is here. Something about the truth being restored here. The truth coming out now. Loneliness is a normal part of life. So both of you guys have been in this energy of learning how to be good on own in order to come into union here. Something here about... There was something here about just, oh, I'm just meant to be alone. This isn't going to work. This isn't for me. But there's something here about, like, realizing that something is meant to take place. I keep getting that. There's, like... Somebody really thought that something was fantasy. So someone thought that they were just going to be alone forever. But then you come along and change things up for them. Leo. Inspiration. So this is about expressing yourself. Being open. Moving through adversity. Like using like a creative energy to move through the challenges. The adversity that you've been through. Um, somebody looks at you as an inspiration. Somebody looks up to you. It's almost like this person is like, you're like showing them the way. There's something about the way that you express your, express yourself that inspires this person. You're an inspiration. You just inspire people in general here. Okay, there's something here about honoring your body. Something about your, your sexual sacred energy here. Somebody's thinking about you sexually for sure. Somebody thought that something was just sex. Like... Somebody thought that it was lust, it was fantasy, it's, it wasn't real because of this. This person felt this strong sexual energy towards you, man. And something here about courage. With the strength from my higher power, I have the courage to overcome any challenge. And that's all that adversity that you've been through. Both been through some, like, challenging things. Somebody looked at you as very courageous. Like, you get over a lot of things like most people wouldn't be able to overcome them and somebody sees that you're a force to be reckoned with i feel like the, you, the person the other person i'm picking up on too like they've been through some things as well here like this is someone that's also very courageous so that's why they admire that about you because that's how they are too let me get one for leo leo lovingly accepting yourself and that's what it all boils down to as well all the adversity, the challenges that you've been through, this is learning to love yourself, accept yourself. And because you're doing this, you're able to pull in a union. Clearing out karma as well. So, man, been clearing up some karma. This other person I'm picking up on could have been clearing out some karma here, but you both have been clearing out karma. And this is about being in this state of mind to pull in abundance, prosperity, love. This is re 
programming your mindset, knowing that you can have all these things for yourself. And you were called on a mission here, clearly with this person I'm picking up on. You both were called on missions to, to clear up some past life karma and move through all the adversity, and that's what you've been doing. I feel like there was some adversity that was placed between the two of you in order to get back together as well, and you've been moving through that as well. You have a mission with somebody here, clearly. It's like you both have a certain mission for self, and now you guys are supposed to come together and like finish a mission together. And you have this divine energy. You're attracting your divine partner towards you. There's something here about both of your guys' energy is like able to like tap into this, this limitless energy that is from the universe here. That abundance, that prosperity, that love. Talk about gators open. Take a leap of faith. Go through it. What is this about gators open? Somebody wants to work on something here with you. This is somebody that sees you working hard on yourself. I feel like you both have been working on things about yourself, and now this is someone who wants to work work this out. They want to they want to work something out. They want to put the work in with you. Tell me more about Gators Open. This person looks at you as very confident, a leader, attractive, powerful. This is somebody that knows that you're a catch, and they're trying. They want to come in here and get you. They. They want this with you, man. So I felt that I should have said that. So there's something here about a jealous, hateful energy that was trying to get in the way of this. There's something here about, ooh, it's very envious. Somebody's envious that something is still working out for you. But somebody wanted something to end. Someone didn't want you to have something here, but there's a wish fulfillment coming in. So there may have had to been like some loose ends that were needed to be tied up, whether it was on your end or this other person's end I'm picking up on. But something ended and somebody's pissed off because somebody ended something with someone else in order to come towards you. This is like healing energy, healers. Somebody views you as a wish fulfillment and somebody wants to come in here and offer you this offer of loyal, stable offer. taking a lot of strength like something here about somebody wanting to come in here and like balance something out with you now this is someone that's tired of holding back there was like some resisting energy that took place between the two of you and now this person is having the strength to come in here and, and uh, balance restore something here between the two of you time out look for the signs there's some kind of signs you could be seeing repeated numbers you could just be seeing things that remind you of your person or you just may be seeing things that know that this union is meant to come into place. And there's something here about just receiving some kind of messages like with your life in general, like being guided and, and like going the right way and just like really like receiving your downloads, your messages from the universe here. Time out, look for the signs. Three of Cups. So first off, somebody was trying to see if there was someone else in the picture. There's something here about something here about this person coming back into union here with you. Like this is like I feel like the, it's like you two are being drawn back to each other. Tell me more about look for the signs. There was definitely some kind of resistance energy here to walk away, but there's something here about some truth coming out. It's almost like somebody tried to walk away from you and they're realizing that you are their person. This is someone wanting to come towards you. You could be seeing their vehicle. You could just be seeing cars that remind you of them. This is like... The, the universe keep is guiding you guys together. I keep getting that. There's something here about the truth and the clarity coming out. And somebody's now coming towards you because they're realizing something here about this connection here. Somebody looks at you as a wish fulfillment. Somebody wants to like pour into you. There's something here about not being in denial about something anymore. Because somebody definitely sees you in this independent energy. Somebody may have thought that they were better off alone because somebody thought that something was too good to be true. And now this person sees you doing your thing and they want to come in here and grab you now. Like this is someone that knows that you are their person and you've been over here minding your business. Um, nourishing your finances nourishing your growth your journey here and this person wants to come in here and get you like they can't resist something anymore here i'm not planning ahead divine timing is aligned right now clearly with this read tell me about that planning ahead so something was left out in the cold because there was something that was like 
whether it was limiting beliefs or loose ends that needed to be tied up on your end, their end. There's some kind of like dark force that was trying to get in the way of this. And you guys both had some kind of dark forces just in your life in general here. So this low vibing energy was trying to like disconnect this divine union that meant to take place here. There was like some guarded resistant energy here. Both have been hurt. Both have been wounded. And this person's been spying and observing you. This is somebody that's in their head right now. This is somebody that wants to invest into you. This is somebody that sees all the hard work that you're doing and they are planning to come toward you invest. Like you could be having sleepless, restless nights or they could. Like this person can't stop thinking about you ever since you two came across each other. They've seen you like they, they want to invest into you. This is someone that was trying to like, so it's almost like there was like an energy where I'm going to run from it. I'm going to, I'm gonna, I, this isn't what it is. I'm going to put my guard up. I'm not sure. I, I'm like overthinking things. But this person can't put the fire out that they feel when it comes to you. This is somebody that wants to speak their feelings to you. They want to like, they want to make this work. Time out illusion here. So somebody thought this was a fantasy, but it isn't. Sorry about that. Hi, Priestess. There's something here about... There's something here about, like, telepathy for somebody. There's something here about you... You both are able to, like, communicate in the 5D. Something about spiritually high-ranked energy with the both of you here. That's why you both have been through so much adversity. So somebody was, like... Somebody's intuition knew that you were who you said you were, but it's like they kept like overthinking things. And there, for some of you, there was some kind of like lies and slander that was trying to like create more resistance. Tell me more about illusion here. Yep, seven wands. Somebody was like, this is just a fantasy. It's just sex-based energy here, but that's not the case. The moon. For some of you, there could have been some kind of spell work that was put on this, this connection to stop something. There was definitely some kind of lies, something here that was said to create, to create something to fall apart. But all it did was make you and your counterpart come back stronger here. There was definitely some kind of spell work here for someone. Someone thought that this was only sex-based energy, and that's not. So there's something here about this person didn't want to get stuck in like another connection where it wasn't. Because I'm picking up on you or both of them. You guys wanted something that's solid. But somebody thought that it was going to be the same thing with the past connections that they dealt with. So this is somebody that is wanting to take action and come towards you here. This person's worried about you having somebody else. I keep getting that too. So this is somebody that knows that this isn't fantasy. And they're wanting to come in here. They're wanting to give something. They, they want to have that equal give and take with you. This is somebody that is like realizing that this wasn't fantasy at all. Like this is my person. I've got Cancer, Pisces. I've got Earth, Fire, Water, Water, Air, Cancer, Capricorn, Earth, Pisces, and uh, Fire here. So somebody thought that because there was illusions being said and the way that they felt with your energy, they thought this was too good to be true. And I'm telling you, this person's been watching your social media. They keep getting pulled back towards you. This is new levels of unconditional love that you both are going to be experiencing with each other. Both have been called to release and let go things to stop them from fully coming into union. I feel like that's what you've both been doing. And there's that faith and destiny coming back out to play. Everything is working out as it should. Leo. I didn't like how that felt, Leo. So this person wants to return to you. This person, you feel like home to this person. They want to return. And there's something here about creative energy here. Something about the way that you express yourself. Like both have some kind of like creative energy. Tell me more. Completion. New worlds are opening up because you both have been going through some hard lessons. So now you're both about to be rewarded. And definitely part of the reward is you guys coming together here. Tell me more. And this is like a foreign energy because you both never experienced something like this before. This person could be at a distance from you. There was definitely distance that was created between the two of you. But now you guys are ready to come back together here. You both have been like 
embracing your journey and moving through the adversity. Tell me, let me get more. There was a lot of indecision that took place here. Somebody didn't want it to entertain another on and off relationship, or you might not have wanted to, to put up with that, but there's this indecisive energy is it's all sh it's all fading away. And this is an unbreakable bond that you have with this person. Strong and stable relationship. A love to last a lifetime is what you have coming towards you. Okay, there, there's something here about a jealous energy that was trying to get in the way of this. This is somebody that's very protective over you. So you both could have some kind of jealousy issues here. So this person doesn't want to share you with anyone else. Like they're coming in to get you. Tell me more. Tell me more. And there definitely was some inner child healing taking place. You both could have youthful appearances, look younger than the age that you are. Could be children. You guys could be creating new children here. And there's those signs again. I can't make this stuff up. You're following the signs, repeated numbers. You could be hearing their name. You could be seeing their car. You could be hearing music that sounds like them. You could just, you're just being reminded, like guided back together. And both of you guys had to realize that you're not alone just because you're by yourself. There's something about loving self, pouring back into self, restoring self in order to come back together. And something's happening quicker than what someone thought here. Somebody wants to come towards you because somebody knows that you're a catch and they don't want you to get away from them. So there's some surprises coming in here. Shocked. Somebody's shocked that you are who you say you are, that you guys are meant to be together. And there was definitely some sacrificing that needed to take place here. This is about aligning with things in order to, to get you guys back in alignment. Both had to give up things from their past in order to come into union as well. Tell me more. And this person's ready to come in here and to they they want to come towards you. They're ready to risk it. And there it is right there, this old-fashioned love. Well, is this somebody that's very romantic? This is somebody that will open the car door for you. It's just, oh, it's, it's very sweet energy I'm picking up on. And two hearts falling in love, man. I can't make this up. The feeling is mutual. Some kind of narcissist. There could have been like narcissistic traits or there could have been like a narcissist trying to get in the way of it. Somebody could have tried to say you were a narcissist. There's something here about superficial energies that were trying to get in the way of this. And there's those sleepless nights I was picking up on. Somebody cannot stop thinking about you. Somebody knows that you are their person here. There was just a lot of in-your-head energy, whether it was both of you or them. Theo. Somebody likes to copy you. Somebody likes to... to I feel like this is this jealous energy that I'm picking up on. And for my ones that are in the spotlight, you just got people that are just trying to copy who you are. Someone likes to steal your ideals and make it seem like they're theirs. No, that's not what's going on. So somebody likes, somebody like really likes, wants to be you. I feel like there's like whoever this jealous energy that was trying to get in the way of, of that's, they want to be you. It's weird. Tell me more. Somebody's watching you for fake accounts. Wherever you're posting, they're watching. Tell me more. Tell me more. Clout hungry. Somebody was making things up, saying anything. Because somebody didn't want you to have an offer. Somebody didn't want you to, like, receive something. They didn't want you to have this love here. There was a lot of craft talking that took place here. Tell me more. Yeah, somebody wanted to seem, make it seem like you were a dirty offer. So there was some, like, dirt digging. Somebody was trying to dig up your past. Let me tell you about people that dig up your past. They ain't got nothing to go on in the present, so they'll dig up your past. And if you're like me, you signed up for a lot of, like, hard lessons because you have some kind of karma to clear up. So your past doesn't define who you are. Just don't let people try to pull you backwards by bringing up your past. Like, the past is in the past. It stays in the past. Tell me more. Tell me more. You're over here hustling, focused on that career, really nurturing your finances here. That's what you're doing. Beautiful. Tell me more. Somebody was trying to make up, man, somebody was really trying to like make some things up here. 
someone could have said that you were sleeping and like you sleeping around or you were like non-committal and you were a cheater so somebody was really going hard to try to like slander something because somebody wanted to cock block something i can't make it up somebody was trying to get in the way of something so there's some comments people looking through your comments it could be this jealous person is definitely this counterpart of yours so somebody's always partying someone could have said that you were always partying if you were in the scene at one time you've laid that to rest this is what you're in now you're in the stable energy just stacking up your pinnacles you got this this person that's got their stuff together that wants to come in here so and the on the counterparts in that I'm picking up on they could have been like in this scene as well and it's like they're learning to release this scene as well this is somebody that wants you this person's got their stuff together Somebody was trying to start some drama. And if somebody had some kind of position of power to try to, like, create drama, they certainly did that. And there's a drama starter. Somebody was trying to make it seem like you weren't making any changes. It's the same thing over and over again. And a lot of you guys had to, like, go through these cycles of the same thing over and over again until you pulled yourself out of those cycles and realized, I don't want to do this anymore. I'm done with this. And I feel like that's what you and your counterpart have been doing here. Leo, hopeless, sinking, falling apart. This person cannot stop thinking about you. They are so hopeless. They want to be intimate with you. They want to confine on you. Like, so there's something here about just the 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 attraction between the two of you is undeniable here. This is somebody that there could have been like some like resisting, scared energy to. To, to be intimate with someone, just having sex with someone doesn't mean intimacy. There's more to intimacy than just having sex. Like intimate is like someone that you can open up and just share things. Like this is like, to me, it's my everything. Like my lover becomes my best friend, my everything. Tell me more. There it is. I can't make it up. This past life connection that you had here. You've got a past life connection here with this person. Somebody wants a second chance with you now. Somebody's realizing that you are their person. And somebody's realizing that they got to go in here and make a move towards you. There was some kind of like abandonment wounds, rejection. Somebody was worried about being rejected. Somebody thought that something was going to not end well. Whether it was on their end, your end, both of your guys' ends. But this is somebody that cannot stop thinking about you. They are longing for you. And somebody definitely tried to, to get in the way and, and cause more doubting energy. But this person's longing for you. They want you. So there's something here about just worried, like something about control and worried about being trapped down. Somebody was conflicted because maybe there was some differences between you and your person. And then whatever gossip that was being said was added to some kind of fear here. So somebody may have ran because they didn't want to feel trapped down. But somebody here is like, they can't stop thinking about you. They want to return. Exactly. This person wants to return. They're coming back for you. They know you're loyal. They know they can trust you. They know that you're reliable. And they're definitely believing what they're seeing when it comes to you. This is somebody that wants to create some new memories with you. And if you guys already encountered each other, like you spent time together, or just remember, like this person is thinking about the, the times that you guys were in contact. They missed that. They want you. Tell me more. Man, the more that you two pull away, the more that this person is obsessing. Like, you both could be obsessing over each other. There was some delays that were put in this connection on purpose because it was for you guys to become stronger. But the energy is undeniable here. Like, this person cannot stop thinking about you. This is somebody now shifting their perspective about you, about this connection. I'm telling you, this person thought it was just sex-based energy. They thought it was just lust. And somebody was trying to definitely create some kind of lies, making it seem like somebody was non-committal here. And now somebody's stressed. Somebody wants a new beginning. Somebody is wanting to release the tension between the two of you. They want to come in here and get you. They're so worried about somebody else coming in here for you. So they're, they're coming back to get you. They want you. Leo. Leo. Exploring feelings. So this is about stepping into the insecurities here. Standing in your authenticity. Learning to 
give yourself closure and not hang on to like open past karmic cycles here. This is like creating, being at peace with your past so it doesn't interrupt your present. My cat's in here if you hear a noise. We have another one, Leah. Dark reflection. When you look into the abyss, the abyss looks back. So truth seeking. This is about shining lights on things about yourself. Lights being sh shined on just the darkness that was trying to stop something from coming together here. Okay, another one. Bring that back up. And escapism. So somebody was trying to like escape something. They thought it was too good to be true. Detaching. This is about learning to relax and just stepping into this union, facing the reality. The person cannot stop craving you, man. I feel it during this whole read. Like, they, look at that. They're ready to tear them bars open and come and get you. Whew, so there's something here about this person. Like, they have so much, whew, they got so much desire for you. A lack of awareness. Somebody wasn't aware of who you were, what this connection was, but I feel like they do now. Insights, opportunities. This is like going after things and no longer missing opportunities because you're second guessing yourself. There's something here about really trusting intuition and divine juggling. So there's some kind of different aspects, like something here about embracing your light and your shadow side. Something about like embracing the progress on your journey and just staying in this harmonious energy, learning to notice like pick up like patterns when it comes to your light and your shadow side and just like working through those embracing them that's who you are but learning to like show up differently say things differently speak things differently just renewing yourself and i'm telling you this person's got some hidden desires for you so longing passion fulfillment this is somebody here that can no longer deny the connection between the two of you they know that you're their person. You guys have some kind of past life connection here for sure. So, all right, my beautiful Leo, that was your guys' message. I hope that it helped and resonated. If it did not, please check back with me on Wednesday. We'll do it all over again. Appreciate you so much. Light and love to you. See you Wednesday.